Russian military forces have seized Europe's largest nuclear power plant located in southeastern Ukraine. That's according to local officials who said earlier on Friday Russian forces attacked the Zaporizhia plant in the middle of the night, setting a nearby training facility on fire. The state emergency service said Friday the fire has since been extinguished, while the International Atomic Energy Agency said essential equipment was unaffected with no change in radiation levels. Speaking on Facebook late on Friday, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky called on Europe to act quickly to prevent a nuclear catastrophe comparable to the Chernobyl disaster of 1986. We are warning everybody, not a single state apart from Russia has ever shelled nuclear reactors. It is for the first time in our history, in the history of humankind, that the terrorist state turned to nuclear terrorism. Russia has already captured the now-defunct Chernobyl plant, which spewed radioactive waste over much of Europe when it melted down. A U.S. energy official said the reactors at Zaporizhia were being safely shut down. But nuclear expert Maria Ross Rubley tells Reuters continued warfare around nuclear plants could result in a disaster worse than Chernobyl. If there is a nuclear meltdown, it is Putin's fault. He's the one who's made the decision to continue this invasion under such dangerous conditions. Russia calls its actions in Ukraine a special operation that isn't designed to occupy territory. Rather, it claims to be going after its neighbors' military capabilities, toppling their democratically elected government, and capturing what it regards as dangerous nationalists.